Mark Edge and I'm the Drought Guard Marketing Lead for Monsanto and I'm here at the American Farm Bureau Association um, com conference to present about Drought Guard to the uh, growers that are attending. So what, what should growers know about drought tolerance? Well growers should know that Monsanto is introducing the world's first biotech trait to help uh, manage the risk of drought tolerance and we're introducing it in a system which is bringing forward both the, uh, or the three things of the system, the agronomics, the biotechnology, and the uh, plant breeding. Okay, so is there a specific area that this is most adapted for? Or? So the area where we're first introducing it is in the Western Great Plains. So we've done their testing in the Western Great Plains in 2012. We did groundbreaker trials out there, about 250 growers in the Western Great Plains. I uh, tested it there. Eventually we expect Drought Guard to be across the whole United States though because drought does affect uh, every acre in America at some point in the, uh, in the life cycle of a farmer. And the name Drought Guard, is that kind of because we can't prevent drought? But It really is to try and help communicate that we don't have a silver bullet, we don't have a simple solution for drought. Basically what we're saying is, is that we're helping to manage the risk and so it's a, it's, um, a way to guard against uh, the risks of drought uh, hitting the farm. And what, what kind of agronomic practices are farmers already doing, or what kind of genetics? What's out there already? There's a lot of things that farmers are already doing, and I think if you actually just compare how the response was to drought in 2012 versus in 1988, you see a big difference in how the crops respond in the overall yield. We're seeing that farmers are using a lot more minimum tillage. Part of that's because they've got Roundup Ready technology. Um, we have better root systems. Part of that's because we have corn rootworm technology. Um, we have just overall better systems of the way to manage through the crops and make sure that we're able to maintain the moisture in the soil in a better way. And so farmers are much better stewards of the land and creating a sustainable system to help manage through the risk of drought. Thanks. That's all I